welcome back to my channel. So if you guys are new here, my name is Kristen and I'm kind of slightly addicted to everything in The Sims 4. And actually this is like the second part of the student dorm like mini room builds. So I will make sure to leave a link down in the description in case you guys maybe want to see something a little bit more feminine and girly with a little bit more pink and purple in it. So I did do one earlier in the week. I believe it was on Sunday. So I will put that down in the description and I will also make sure to leave a link down there as well in case maybe you guys wanted to download this room and put it into your game. So it's probably going to be under like frat boy dorm or something like that. So I did keep the like original shape of this room the exact same as the like girlier dorm and I felt like it was just it made more sense because I feel like if we're kind of like working within like the same theme and university I feel like all of the rooms they are gonna look the same and then you're just gonna have to play around and I really want to make each of them look really different so I would love to know down in the comments if you guys kind of like this little challenge and if maybe you guys would like to see more from this because as of right now I have only did two but if you guys do like it, I can do some different themed ones for next week. Maybe something like a little less cluttered. I did have a comment on the girlier one that um, somebody would like to see it like with less clutter, but I feel like if you are doing these dorm rooms, you have like limited space and limited organization. So I feel like sometimes you might actually have like a bit of clutter because you really are not gonna have that much area to put like your projects and like your school stuff and like everything that you're gonna need to actually live with. So I kind of spoke about it like in the other build that a lot of the dorms around here, they are with like two roommates, like each room, they're kind of like longer and really narrow rooms. And then on each side of the room, usually is like a closet or a wardrobe. And then you have like the bed up against the wall. And each person kind of has like each side of the room to do with what they want. So I think it would have been really fun to see something like a mini fridge or something in the game to like put in the closet because um, when you are going off to college or university here, that's kind of one of the things everybody gets as like their going away present is like a mini fridge to take up so that you can have like a little bit of food and like um, a hot plate or something like that to kind of make like your noodles and stuff like that. But I would love to do maybe like a geekier themed or like a book, like a bookworm or like artist kind of room. I think these are so much fun. And I feel like when you are doing these like really small rooms or bedrooms or things like that, I feel like you can put a lot of the Sims personality into the rooms because it's such a limited space. I feel like you can really take the time just to kind of like capture whichever personality of your Sim lives here. And I kind of really want to do like a minimal one. I actually have another small build for a house going up later in the week, probably on Thursday. And I have been having so much fun doing these like smaller builds. I feel like I can really put more into them for like personality because I feel like sometimes when you do like family homes and things like that, you just kind of have like a general traditional look. But I really love doing these themes and sometimes it gets me to use some items that maybe normally I wouldn't usually use. But I really hope that you guys like how it turned out. I definitely had a lot of fun and I actually ended up creating this room, this dorm, like on the exact same day that I did the girlier room because I had so much fun doing it. And I really hope that you guys like it and I'm kind of like hoping to get some comments for like a request to do more of these because I really, really Really love how it turned out. They're definitely a lot of fun and I mean you can either take like a whole bunch of these dorm rooms because not only myself but a lot of people here on YouTube have actually been creating a lot of these like smaller dorm rooms so you can kind of like put them all together and kind of like maybe create your own dorm house or like a frat house fraternity house or something like that or I mean if you just kind of liked this for maybe a teenager in your game and you're already 
already like playing the game, you can definitely put this into your game as a room and just kind of like resize it to fit into the house that you're actually currently using. So like I said, I hope that you guys like how it turned out. I had an absolute blast. And if you are not already subscribed to my channel here on YouTube, definitely consider subscribing. I do try to post um, at least five videos each week. I know it goes, it ranges from four to seven, like every other day to daily, just kind of like depending on how motivated or if there's like a new pack that's come out. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I really hope that I get to see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Thank you.